I'm making a quick video with my shopping haul from the local deli. The delis are everywhere are all the same. Fruit is cheaper, but it's really ripe. Therefore, why do people go to supermarkets, pay double to get fruit that you shouldn't eat because it's just full of starch and not even pleasant to eat because there's no sugars in there kind of thing. You get my gist? Let's have a look. <laughs> Wait, first of all, guess how much it costs. You'll be wrong and I'll remind you. A few of them are a bit squashed, but okay, this would cost like at least five, six quid and it's really ripe. Mmm, 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 but three quid. I'm going to basically freeze all of them and I'm going to put them to smoothies. I'm going to eat them as a, like an ice cream, like a lollipop and just like mess about with them. I might make another banana bread or something. Well, I need a, I need a container. Just any Tupperware. I'll quickly just like run for it because I'm going to, I'm doing it anyway, you know. Here's the bin. Really, really handy. It's just creamy. It's sweet, but. I don't try to eat too fast because you can get really gassy. I've got to try to bite through all of it. It's really funny because my mum was like, if you eat so much fruit and veg, it's like you end up eating all day. And that's kind of, that epitomizes the Western mindset to food, that it's got to be fast, quick, and you forget about it. And maybe that's part of the problem when it comes to diet related diseases or diseases that are, are related to diet and lifestyle, but people still contest that that's the case. I <laughs> don't drink alcohol, but Alcohol from bananas could be interesting. Because these are perfect. I'll show you it. Look at that. Into the freezer. Um, give me one second, I'll finish the rest. I've always wanted to do this. And this is a one I made earlier. <laughs> Just the one there. Now, compared to that, I really love this. If this was in the shop, and you know what they do? Tangent. It's amazing. This is so tasty. Oh, it's so cold. Oh. And these are going to be used to make the most amazing lollies. This bag has been torn, so I can't save it. I really should have reusable bags, to be honest but I can't fit everything in my rucksack. Guess how much two of these cost? Yeah, you guessed it, because it's in a bowl, it's for a quid. Where you usually find one of these for a quid itself, so, quid's in. I was having to film undercover right in front of the security guard. In a typical supermarket in Britain, you can get a lime for about 30p, if it's well priced. Guess how many I got? Six for a quid. We're gonna be making some lovely, lovely drinks. It's funny because a lot of supermarkets are really funny about any camera work, be it professional or amateur. Butternut squash. You can, oh, mmm. <laughs> how much did it cost? Yeah, in the supermarkets, <laughs> you'd get something like half this size for a quid if you're lucky. This is huge. Also one pound. Oh wait, I forgot I have more. I'm gonna reuse that. Guys, guess how much I got. Not even four, I was gonna say. Five avocados. I got it for a quid, yes. I'm not even gonna play this game anymore because it's just too easy. <laughs> Five. One, I remember, photographic memory, cost 69p in Lidl. And Lidl is a budget, cheaper, discount supermarket. <laughs> These are on the smaller side, I'll give you that. But they cost easily a pound. It's ridiculous. Well, I got five for a pound. And that's really important because I really want to be eating at least 
one to one and a half, maybe two of these smaller ones a day because I don't like eating nuts all the time, but these have a lot of calories and uh, they're just so creamy and it's like a dip when they're really ripe and these are really perfect. To be clear, every scoop a bowl is one pound. Gonna reuse that. You know what? What kind of frustrates me is that apples are really expensive. To be fair, this season has just started here in the Northern Hemisphere in Europe. No kidding, these are garlands. So it's not any old apple, really crunchy, really sweet. It's actually quite good. I hate eating with my mouth full. That's eight apples. These would cost at least 150 to two pounds. Also a quid. But delis are really awesome because you can actually eat the fruit straight away, which is key. These are smaller mangoes, I give you that. A slightly larger one costs easily two pounds in the supermarket again. I got three for a quid, they're on the smaller side, but I felt them all up, like you do, like you do. It smells more aromatic when they're riper, they're small, they, they give off some kind of aroma as opposed to sterile, bland ones in the supermarket. Free for a quid. And uh, I'm really looking forward to getting my hands stuck in these. And look at all these Look at all these grapes. Like that would be in a small packet in a supermarket, which would cost about 180, 170. I get two of those for, you guessed it, one pound. If you shop like this, then eating like a lot of good food doesn't become too difficult. You just have to actually go and buy it and look for it in the deli. Of course, you know, I have to get off your ass. <laughs> and not stop at McDonald's because it's quick. <laughs> Supermarkets are so mainstream. And 50 years ago, everyone shopped in groceries. Supermarkets have only arisen in the last few decades. Why should we support them? Why? Why? Because at the end of the day, it's on average half the price. It's on average twice as sweet, half as sour, half as bland. Half as bland, it's not bland at all. You just get more for your buck. If you like this video, Give me a thumbs up. I'll see you next time. Thanks for tuning in. It's always a pleasure. And uh, subscribe if you haven't subscribed already so you can see more of my craziness. I am so happy I got this. This will last me at least for a couple days. I don't like going shopping every day. Now I have to think of loads of little recipes. But honestly, I don't understand. Sure, you want to jazz up the food, but sometimes you can eat it really simply. Like, I'm going to have a couple of avocados by themselves. Depends how big, I've had some big apples before, but I can have these in one go. That's a little snack. I do love those airy fairy vegan kind of meals online. They do look really pretty. And I'm gonna try my hand at them to be honest, but, but this is kind of what you need. Hey guys, I have a really big shout out to everyone. If anyone's creating music, send it my way or any suggestions, send it my way. I'm gonna go back to my apple and editing for now.